Alright guys, welcome, welcome to Chris Control Automation. Yeah. So we are under our training and today this is what we did. Uh, this is called three position selector swing, okay? So the, this is called a off and this is a normal open. So depending on where you, you toggle these two, it will become a normal close, okay? So if we push this down here, this will become a normal close for the remote. To push it up here to become a normal control for the local position so we're going to operate an induction motor in the both local and remote position so let's go to the practical and see how it works okay so the selector switch as you can see is in its off position okay yeah. it's neither toggled to here or there yeah. so this is for the local and this is for the remote yeah. so my friend here Gordon is going to turn into the local and we'll yeah. operate and you see how it works all right so Alright, okay. so, so you can see that. Okay. So we are operating in the local, and that means that you can operate at the remote because it's already set on the local. Yeah. Nothing is happening here because we didn't put it on the remote. So we're going to use the top to stop the motor. Okay, until we toggle this to the remote, you can operate it at the remote. You see that it's not working. So Gordon, you turn it onto the remote. Alright. Alright, so go ahead. Awesome. That's how it works. And that means that you can also own it from here because we have access uh, to operate in the remote. Okay, we can operate in the local position. So you can it cannot work here until this is set to um, the local. So that's how it works. And this is the project of today. And this is really awesome. We're having fun here. Alright, so now we're going to stop the motor. Okay, so we're going to turn this back in the off position. Now that the selector switch is in the off position, you can neither start it at the remote or at the uh, local. You can start it in either places. Neither of them can be started. Until you set this on either the local or the remote, yeah. that's how it works, okay? As my brother already explained a lot of things here, and this is Chris Control Automation Team, Draw and Build. I will urge you for you to come for this program. It has been a nice program, and I and my brother have been learning a lot of things. So if you are interested, contact our master. There are a lot of release, a lot of everything I hear, PLC, and a lot. If you really want to become an engineer, please contact Chris Control Automation. Thank you very much. Uh, just to add more emphasis, you can see that the materials are here. You will build yourself, you will draw yourself, and then you will build yourself. He has also got his YouTube channel. Uh, Instagram channel, Facebook, you will learn a lot, quiz question, you answer question on this. So while you are living here, you'll be learning from the uh, the channels and this is really amazing. Engineers, you know, hit us up and we'll give you more information about Chris Control Automation. He has got four models, okay? This is Hilal Iman, technical student here. So we're uh, just here having fun and we entreat that you guys join us have fun here, okay? Have a good one.